Hello everyone, welcome back. We're going to be doing another game with you today. This game came out today, uh, and the game is currently £2.89. It's called Escape, and the description states, Welcome to Chayanne, Chain, Chenny, Chain, I don't know how to pronounce that, but Welcome to Chain, uh, Welcome to Chain Escape Game Series. This is the first work. Of course, this is only first chapter. The follow-up will soon update the second and third chapters. Please look forward to it. Okay, so it sounds uh, interesting. It seems like we're going to be getting multiple parts. It's got one review already, which we can't see for some reason. I'm not sure uh, why. Maybe it's in a foreign language. Oh, yeah, there we go. Uh, it's in a foreign language. Okay, that's fine. Okay, so let's get right into the gameplay. I haven't played this before recording, so it's going to be a new experience for both me and you guys watching. Okay, so uh, we're greeted with some pleasant music. We've got a very simple UI, uh, which seems to be both for console and PC, which is nice, supported by both, uh, or certainly control or play. Uh, we've got a settings menu, which you know, it functions exactly as you expect, actually quite a nice menu, uh, which is awesome. So let's go ahead and click new game. Oh, okay, right into it. Um, no sort of explanation as to why we're here, but okay. So it's raining outside, you can hear that, and you can also see the storm, which is nice. Take a picture of the locked door. You can get information by taking pictures. Okay, uh, I'm not exactly sure how to do that. Oh, camera. Okay, camera added. Inventory is empty. Now those doors are the wrong way round, surely. Unless they're sliders, which they don't look like they are. There's no key in the inventory. Yep, I'm aware of that. Uh, nice models, uh, nice textures as well. Um, the game looks quite pleasing, which is really, really nice. I've played some really crappy ones recently, so uh, this might be a bit better. Okay, how do I take a picture? Let's have a look. Keyboard and mouse. Use Cameroid. Is that what they're called? Cameroid? Maybe. Um... So let's see. An undeveloped photo that needs a shake. So taking a picture of the door opened it. It doesn't really make any sense. But let's try it with this one. So it only worked with one door. Uh, we've got 28 pictures left. Well, hello there. Single candle on your own. Very eerie looking school. This looks like um, like a Japanese school. I've seen, or, Ch or Chinese, I, I don't know the exact one, but I've seen similar looking schools in some horror games and some uh, anime series. No key card in inventory. Well, yeah, that's right. I mean, you can damn well be sure I'm going to try and go in these other rooms, because there might be something of use. What is that? Oh, it's just a shiny texture on the banister there. Yeah, it's definitely sufficiently dark. It's going to force me to go upstairs, I think. A barricade? This door's been taken completely off its hinges? Rollers? I think they're roller doors. I didn't see that other door open. I wasn't paying attention. Is that a door? Or... Yeah, it's a door. Okay. Oh, there's some shine on the floor from the lights. That's a really nice little attention to detail. Even the books look really nice. I 
texture. They're all they're all pre-modeled books, uh, as opposed to just like a flat texture. Really nice. Uh, well, the textures on the wall get considerably worse towards this one door, which makes me want to not go in that door. I'm not supposed to go this way just yet. So we'll go upstairs instead. The thing is, it's like, take a picture of the door, um, but I don't want to waste my camera roll on all the doors in case I need to use it somewhere else. Oh, the stairs are blocked off too. Oh, well, I'll get, I guess in that case we'll try and open some of these other doors. Classroom 1A. Oh. That actually did give me some information. Well, that, I think, is the same classroom, so... Will it do the same with this one? A useless photo. Okay. I'm ever so sorry that that's a useless photo. What this is, but I think that's outside. Oh, look at that! Water effect! That's nice. So then I must have missed something over here then. Okay guys, welcome back. So uh, apparently there's something to do uh, with the, the ball, but I'm not entirely too sure. So we're going to go back there and see if we can shoot it again with the camera and maybe uh, maybe like uh, do it from further away this time. I mean... There was something on the floor. Hmm. I guess I didn't see anywhere that I could uh, put the ball or shoot the ball. Perhaps there was something in one of the other classrooms. This ball does not fit in. It looks entirely, entirely new and shiny. Maybe I'll put out the candle with it. Oh, what's this? Nice ball physics on it. I like the sound effect of the ball too. Ah, oh, gosh, I don't know. Yeah, so it's not just me. Uh, other people seem to... Well, the other person seemed to have the same problem. Um, there was no direction, so... Um, I guess what I'm going to have to do is leave some feedback in the Steam page and ask the developer if they can provide next steps. I saw something there. That's blood, right? is definitely something going on there. So let's come out here for a second. No, I have absolutely no idea. I'm sorry that this hasn't been longer or a bit more thorough. The game looks incredible. Um, really, really nice models, nice textures. The environment is really, really good. The lighting is not too dark to make the game annoying. It's not too bright to make it too easy to see things. The only thing that needs to be refined here is 
what you actually do, because taking pictures of doors isn't really fulfilling my joy meter in real life, so um, I'll come back and visit this again if I get a response from the developer, but right now it's it's unfortunately not worth the money because there's just no direction. I could, I could spend ages clicking on every door, but I already tried taking a picture of all the doors and nothing. So we'll leave it there for now. Um, hopefully you guys found this uh, video interesting in some ways. Um, I do look forward to coming back to this if I can. Um, so hopefully everyone enjoy the rest of your day. If you like my video, think about leaving a like and subscribing. And I'll see you all next time.